so my first impression was that she's super rude <laughs> and like uh, she's not my type because she was like what's up everyone welcome to another video we just ended last vlog if you haven't watched it go and check this out right now we are on our way to mount shasta and it's it's pretty mountain and we also have a lake over there so mm -hmm. we're gonna try to go to the lake and then just explore and spend time over there yeah you excited yeah i'm excited i don't think we've ever been together so yeah it's gonna be really fun let's do it we also need to fill up gas so we're gonna do that <laughs> Petrol price is three dollars thirty nine cents for one gallon, so roughly about what is three dollars like two hundred and fifty rupees for four liters. Also, we are very hungry because we haven't had any breakfast other than coffee, so we might go inside there, get some food, and then start our journey back to. There's so many things. Okay, filled up the gas, uh, took our snacks, uh, not so healthy, kind of some protein bars, some chips, some... We're going on a hike. Yes. That's it, that's the mountain. I think we made it. It's super dark. I can't know. I can't even see. Okay. Yeah, I can see. It's 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 taking a little longer. We made it. This is the spot. You can see behind us. Uh, there is the beach right there, or like lake, which is called Lake Sis Siskiyou, Siskiyou Beach. Yeah. We just asked him, and he said we can go over there. And it's really nice weather. It's so nice and cool. Mom, if you're watching this, we gotta come here again. I should say, Mom, when you watch it, not if, because I know you watch our vlogs. Yeah. <laughs> like, well, not one time, like five Why? times. <laughs> Maybe 50. <laughs> Alright, there are a lot of people here. We're gonna keep moving forward if we can find like a spot where it's a little less crowded. Wow, look at that. Okay, so that's the Mount Shasta and that's the beach. It's so awesome. Although there are a lot of people and kids around, yeah. we gotta find a safe spot where Let's they have at that least. Way maybe. That way? Okay. Yeah. So I guess the way they have done it like this, you can book one of this. I mean, not book, but you can just first come, first serve basis. And then, then you can get the next one or the other one. So the beach is right there where all the people are. We are still gonna keep going further. But we hope that there's one spot where we can just go where there's gonna be at least no people. We just have to keep going forward. <laughs> like every small spot has been taken. All right, we found this spot. There's a family right there. But the mountain is right there, you can see. All right, I think it's time for drone shot. So let's run away to far away places. Escape from this life we have known. Your eyes are new worlds to discover. Your heart is the place I call home. to see it when you're home yeah i think we got a pretty good drone shots all right we're gonna walk around this totally reminds me of like bollywood movie oh really the trees yeah i think so comment below isn't it like the doesn't this like the location reminds of like some bollywood movie 
like Caitlin is busy taking some pictures Sorry. but I hope uh, that uh, you guys have uh, opportunities to visit such places we found this nice little spot with the view right here so we're just gonna spend more time over here we are right now reviewing our puppies uh, photos Bruno's photo look at this photo such a great also we have Bruno's YouTube channel so whenever when we get the dog we're gonna do dog training videos like dog dog stuff video link in the description so go and subscribe if you would like to see Bruno <laughs> more in action okay welcome to the kind of first episode of our love story we're gonna talk about how we met like the first impressions of each other the way it starts is like I think in the first semester after my first semester I became the president of Indian student club and then Caitlin was, I was like, leaving. basically like a president but I went to new college at the time so I couldn't be the president of a Chico State club but I was Kind, kind of, of like leading a club, leadership, yeah. It's international students club. But like every other Tuesday, basically students would sign up to talk about their country that they're from. They would bring their food. They would have music. They would talk about it. And it's just a cool way for other people at Chico State community to really get to know a certain culture and like people from a different country than them. Yeah. And just kind of get like a lot of experience and like knowledge about that and make friends. And it was nice That for... is also a very good reason why you should be involved. <laughs> <laughs> but like a couple of my friends were already going to uh, her club and attending the event. So one of our friends, uh, he said to me that Caitlin is my type. And I was like, what do you mean? And it's like, oh, she's like, you know, very career oriented. She's like, uh, very nice and kind and so you will really like her like you should just come to one of the events and I was like yeah we'll see and then it just happened that they contact they wanted to host Indian cultural night so she contacted me mm -hmm. I actually I remember that because um, one of the other leads with me she was like hey can you contact his name's Pratah she goes by Yudi um, like one of the students told us one of the Indian students that she knew uh, said that oh he's gonna do the presentation and so you need to contact him so I contacted you on Facebook super yeah. like straightforward like hey like I'm Caitlin I'm part of international neighbors on Chico State campus like I heard you're doing the presentation this you know I think it was February 2nd I, I heard you doing the presentation February 2nd you know and he's like Oh, I think you were like, oh, I am? Like, you were like kind of surprised because nobody had told you at that point. Yeah, I was like, I think everything was booked out and I, we didn't know a lot of details. We knew that we were thinking about doing it, but we wasn't, we weren't sure like it, it was like confirmed, like we are on the calendar. I contacted her saying, this was like two days before the event, I was like, hey, I'm really interested and you know, I'm looking forward to meeting you and meeting everybody and I, so so my first impression was that she's super rude and, <laughs> and like uh, she's not my type because she was like it, it felt like so short because when she talked to me uh, on Facebook it was on Facebook and yeah. she's like uh, that's great do you need anything else and I was like uh, I was like hoping to make a conversation <laughs> like she would be excited and she would ask me questions and things like that but it wasn't like that but there's also like a little bit of background with that too because I so I joined the club international neighbors before the school union started in August so it was like I think it was like July when yeah. I started to um, meet up with international students and you know students who had just come in early before fall semester started and working with them a lot and I had been really super bubbly and super friendly but in some cultures that can be seen as like flirtation and I so I had been friendly to international students but they thought I was flirting with them and then it made it super awkward when I was like no like I just see you as friends like and nothing more than that so I felt like from that point on I'm gonna just be very like straight straightforward to the point and like I, I definitely got more friendly once I oh, yeah. knew Yudi after, and like who he was after the first event itself we, we talked yeah, more yeah but yeah, so that was my first impression that she's super rude, super like short and on the point to talking and I was like, this is, there's no way she's like nice and like she didn't talk to me at all. 
but then the event happened and i'll put the picture right here we did a lot of like you know fun presentation and one of the best things she liked about the whole presentation was that i made everybody stand up on national anthem so i i guess that's not common over here it wasn't common i none of the not i think after you did that other students kind of followed that uh, it was a really nice tribute to the country and really respectful and just a way for everyone to show respect to your country and for you to pay tribute to that yeah. and i thought that was really nice then i think the event happened and after the event was done we served the food and it, there was one funny incident happened where you know first we, obviously we served everybody and then once we knew that everyone has a hat then we had this Indian team who was helping us then i was like okay now you guys can eat and then everyone was just like just, they're they're just going it. for the food because it's free food yeah. obviously <laughs> and then caitlin comes and she's like she wants she wanted a rice pudding or yeah. kheer i mean little did i know yudi was actually serving the rice pudding at that yeah. moment which is kind of funny i didn't even realize it until now it was i wasn't serving i think oh, just, everybody like, was everybody was there and then uh, you came and i was like waiting patiently yeah. Yeah, you were like okay let, I, and they're all huddled around yeah it. we were hoping that everyone will like move away and you can so i was like oh what do you want you were like can i get one more cup of rice pudding i was like oh yeah yeah hey, hey. <laughs> 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 that move? was really funny because it was very much like everybody move and i think you said it i don't even think you said it in english i think you said something in hindi, hindi yeah yeah i was like are ruko ruko yeah <laughs> and i was like what is going on i'm like this is my nice service though <laughs> wow but i took you like why I put the one bowl and then I gave it to her. Mm-hmm. So yeah, and I think that that was, and and there was one more part where we were like trying to find a table. Oh, yeah, that was really cute yeah, because like, I was like sitting at a table with like some of my friends from the international club and Yudi and Abhinav. Abhinav. Yeah. You guys were both like kind of walking because a lot of seats were taken, so you were trying to find a spot. And there was a spot close to us. So I was like, "Hey, do you guys want to sit with us? You can sit right here." And they're like, "Okay, sure." <laughs> this, this is like an advice slash suggestions, uh, which is kind of something important. To remember is like Americans are like super friendly, so they don't mind if you go and ask, uh, like if you go up to them and like ask questions or want to be friends or at least want to talk to them. I, I was nervous in the beginning but when they they called us in the when they called us I was like okay I mean we can just go and then I I don't even remember the conversation it was more like just like how did you like it and you know more about cultural questions and I things like that like and we kind of started talking from there and then I was like oh you're like you're British and cuz we had talked a little bit on yeah. Facebook and uh-huh. so I was like oh okay that's right you know and we kind of just started chatting right. but I felt like I know for myself the when you sat down and we were talking with us I was like oh he's like really easy to talk to yeah and like that was really nice for me and like I felt very comfortable yeah cuz sometimes with different people from different cultures you just don't know what the cultural dynamic is and you don't want to say anything like wrong that but you like, yeah I don't know even I even my like even uh even my first impression which was like she's rude and she's not kind that was all gone because when I, as soon as I met her because she's like super sweet and kind and she's like talking to everybody not just me yeah. but like a lot of all the other indians even like chinese people mm-hmm. japan japanese people korean people like she was this like very friendly to everybody and like she would go to different tables and like and like hey, check in yeah, yeah. <laughs> how's it going how's it going are you having fun and things like that so it 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 the the first impression wasn't the last impression it was just the first impression and then it changed but yeah that's basically how we met uh, so sweet like remembering everything i know so we don't talk about it all the time yeah. but it's really sweet thinking back on it and i feel like but, Yeah. It would be fun to bring up old messages and kind of read back and forth. Yeah. And, and the next conversation in the next episode whenever we do the next part of this love story is where how we started chatting that night <laughs> itself we started chatting yeah. uh on Facebook and it, it was like the, a lot. Yeah. It was we, a lot yeah, of chatting. But we'll talk about that in the next video. But let us know if you guys want to know more about our love story in this type of format. Obviously, it'll be more different because we'll have two cameras proper mic and podcast yeah. style so but yeah
that or was maybe that was, we can do it outside like this. Maybe, yeah. I'm I'm like so excited because I want to share so much like how we got started dating and then how I met her mother. That, that was, was funny. like I was telling her like how how nervous I was and all maybe of that. Funny with but let's not let's oh, not give it yeah, let's not idea. give it up. So, uh, you guys need to comment and let us know that if you guys want to know more about our love story. I would love to like this is fun. It's is fun, really for fun for us, for us uh, yeah. to just remember and talk about it. But I hope you enjoyed it. Okay. Bye beach. I will see you very soon. Then we're gonna end the vlog over here. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Until our next one. Keep smiling. Keep hustling. Love.